Hi all, welcome to BA Careers. Business Analysis for Beginners. Hope all are doing well. In this video let us observe what sanity testing is. I want to talk about what is sanity testing and who will do the sanity testing and few advantages by performing sanity testing. There are many testing methods. Sanity testing is one of the methods. Topics covered in this article. Topics covered 1. What is sanity testing? 2. Who will do the sanity testing? 3. The best way to do sanity testing. 4. Sanity testing steps 5. Advantages of sanity testing 1. What is sanity testing? In sanity testing, once development is completed, build will be generated and same will be released for testing. User tests the functionality of the software build. Whether the functionality is working as per requirement or not. User tests whether critical functionalities are working or not. In simple terms we can tell. Sanity testing focuses on testing specific functionality after making changes to the code and fixing any bugs. The aim is to make sure that any reported bugs have been fixed and that the specified functionality works correctly. 2. Who will do the sanity testing? It depends on the organization. In some organizations business analysts will do the sanity testing to ensure no bugs or less bugs in application. It helps business analysts to understand the application functionality. Here we need not to execute all the test cases. We can test some important and critical test cases. Or else we can review the test case results if this is done by the CAR team. 3. The best way to do sanity testing as we discussed in the above point. It is up to the team and organization how to perform sanity testing. There is no particular method or document to perform sanity testing. 4. Sanity testing steps as we discussed there is no particular order or steps to perform sanity testing. But we will try to follow some tips to ensure critical functionalities of the application are working. 1. Identify. First understand the requirement and functionality of the application. Then identify what needs to be tested. It is required for any type of testing. This includes functionality. 2. Features and modifications that were introduced to the relevant code or build. 3. Validate. The testers will check and validate all of the identified functionality, features, and modifications from the above step. 4. Testing. Team will test all the functionalities, features and modifications from the above step. This ensures that application functionality is working as expected. 5. Advantages of sanity testing. As team tested end-to-end -end functionality, it helps to avoid escalation from the client. As functionality has fewer bugs or no bugs, it improves client satisfaction. As team tests on concentrated functionality, it is easy to identify the bugs. There are many testing methods, functional testing, and integration testing, sit black box testing, regression testing, smoke testing and all. I hope this video provided you with an overview of what sanity testing is and how to do sanity testing. If I miss out anything please mention in comments. So that it helps us to cover in coming videos. You can click on the link below to get more articles. Happy learning. All the best. If you like this video. Please like and subscribe to our channel. Thank you.